Them will go through to the lower translation. When I'm done with it, I let you go. But you know what God put in my mind? And that's what I'm going to do this morning. Even though I didn't announce it properly during the week, I didn't announce that's the truth. God asked me to pray for every one of you that have people living abroad that are not doing well. And as I finish this prayer this morning, I will hear your testimony. Amen. <laughs> that's why I tell you it's a special day. That's what I have in mind. I wanted to say it on Wednesday. I was over carried away. I wanted to say something and give us and I forgot. But that's what God asked me this morning to say and to do. Now, verse number two, let's go first. What did he say? He said, Praise him for his mighty acts. Praise him according to his word, excellent greatness. Wait, come back to it. Come back. Praise him. For he what? His mighty heart. He said, praise him according to his excellent his mighty act. His excellent greatness. Now, let's still go in verse 3. We are coming back to it. He said, praise him with what? The sound of the trumpet. Praise him with the plastery and what? Let's see go. We are stopping our seats, then we'll come back again. We are going to do our revise again. Come back. That's what I want you to say this morning. He said, verse 4 said, praise him with what? Trim bells. And the dance. Some of us know savvy dance. <laughs> praise him with what? Strange instrument and organs. At times I begin to look at how Bible recommend praises the dimensions, the level, the instrument that God desired from us. And he discovered a time he said we never even got to half of it. 
shows that our God is still waiting for we to praise him. He's still waiting for we to worship him. Put it verse 5. He said, praise him upon the loud are you there? A loud cymbals. Praise him upon the high sounding cymbals. Now, do you know what is called cymbal is what you have here now. At times, the way you play it, the sound is louder than the drum. Now, let's see go. Now, verse 6 was the climax. What did he say? Let everything that has bread. Now, wait. Do you know what it means? No matter condition you find yourself, as long as you are still pretty, God believe you are owing him praises. Now, God, you don't know how my, I was badly injured yesterday. That is your own. He said, let everything that has bread. And when I read this scripture, I discover that even the bears, they sing to him. He said, let everything, no human being, the other thing that has bread, am I correct? He said, let them praise him. Whenever I read this scripture, I remember this song that I say, Chine konye de kage, oh, chine konye de kage, chine konye de kage, oh, chine konye de kage, ano manu ne kuse, ani ne ne kuse ni di ma, omo no no ne kuse, ani ne ne kuse ni di ma, ebe papa no kiwe, ani ne ne kuse ni di ma. Now let's look at something as Psalm 91 verse 12. Is this Psalm 91 verse 12? Let's go. We are coming back home. He said, He will do what? And they shall bear thee in their hands, and thou shalt not dash thy foot against a stone. Talking about God's protection, right? Let's look at 11. Let's still look at 11. For he shall do what? Give his angel charge over you. Now, you see, the way you praise him determines your protection. Let me tell you, many of us, we don't, you see, if it comes to warfare, we can do warfare in the means of our challenge. Fire! Oh! But you see, worship is a very hard task. Talk to me. One of my neighbors those days, when we, we, we live together, we pray together. So, every time when we come for prayer, I would like us to start with singing, singing. He called me one day, I said, Pastor. He said, because when we are singing, he will sit down like a full hand, like a bird that is catching cold. I keep watching this man. At times it will flow. At times it will not flow. So, one day, I was talking to him. I said, I used to joke, tell him, I said, okay, you're not supposed to become pastor since we have been doing this prayer together. You are supposed to have been, you know, improving more than this. As my one year region now for, but you hallelujah. As you know what it means. Say, I think who chop the food. Now they shout at In the other way, he was trying to tell me, say, market no good. <laughs> if you see the way he will phone hand, even on that, you know, you phone hand, wait for us, move her like this. But the day itself, if you raise this song, you collect it from your hand. So I noticed that it's not all steady. Now let's look at Psalm 92. I want to show you something more briefly. I will go. Let's look at verse 10, verse 11, verse 12. He said, But my home shall thou exalt like the horn of what? And unicorn. And sh I say, I shall be anointed with fresh oil. Verse 11. He said, my eye also shall see my desire of my enemies. And my ear shall hear my desire of the wicked that raise up against me. Then verse 12. What did he say? The righteous shall flourish like a palm tree. He shall grow like a cedar in Lebanon. Now watch this. If we must flourish like a palm tree, you know, palm tree is one of the best economic trees. Everything about palm tree is special. In fact, you only explain it from your own dialect or your language how you make use of it. In every tribe, there's a way they make use of it. Am I correct? Even some waste part you call waste, some people still make use of it. 
everything about it. Nothing is waste, except you don't know how to harvest it. But everything about palm tree is special. So one that was meditating on this scripture in verse 12, I said, God, why did you say the righteous will flourish? If you look at 10, 11, it's different from the statement in verse 12. He said, we will be anointed, we will see our desire in the enemy, but he said, we shall flourish. That word flourish is not just talking about prosperity, it's still talking about security. My desire to the wicked means that the wicked around me, they cannot harm me. You know, God said to David, he said, root thou in the midst of your enemy. In Psalm 23, he said, I will prepare a table before you in the presence of your enemy. What does God mean? It doesn't mean, he means that he, he will bless you and he will protect you and that blessing which he gave to you will be preserved. But the secret lies in your worship and your fellowship to God. Now, check in the village, those of you of us who grew up in the village. Before you see a wind, all those terrible wind that finish corn and other trees in the village, before you see wind that pull palm tree, I don't know where that wind come. Talk to me. And it, do you know it's the tallest tree in the bush? Talk to me. The tallest. Go to, some of the palm trees have lasted more than, in fact, some of us don't even know when they planted them. And yet, the ground where he's standing is dry, but yet, you don't look at him by his stature. <laughs> Even when you look at it, the roots are not too much. Small, small roots. Have you thought, if you have, you found the boy, you see, when you're near it, it's like sponge. Mango root is more bigger than the one of palm tree. But yet, mango is in danger with the wind. And yet, the one that has small roots is well protected. Have you not seen some palm tree? Even when you look, go through close to the root, it's not protected. Very small thing holding the thing, but breeze will blow. Wow, wow, yet he's standing. One day I was meditating, the Spirit of God told me, if man must flourish like palm tree, we will have the attitude of a palm tree. And I asked God, what is that? He said, most times when we have problems, we are complaining. God don't want your complaint. If you look at Psalm 50 verse 6, he said, let everything that has spread. As long as you are breathing, forget what you went through. God, no one knows say you are crying. Thank him. If you want to come out of that danger, it's gratitude. God, what am I thinking? If you don't know what to thank him, thank him for your life. You may have lost everything, but your life is still there. Uh -huh. And I asked God, he said, palm tree does not behave like other things. If you go village, anytime you go, confirm what I'm telling you. When there is wind, God, he said, he clap and bow. He said, when you have the attitude of clapping and bowing, he said, the Almighty will surround you. But in a situation when you are showing your power, all oh, that thing is, look at their movement when there is wind. They are showing their power. The Bible says, by strength shall no man. <laughs> and that's why the thing will cut their root. Boom! And they will land. But when it comes to palm tree, he go clap. Come and join me, sing and praise him. He will bow. And God say no, he can't reach it. And the wind will come through life, through the, you will see the hand will go up, will go up, it will bole, it will bole. Ah. God say, if you must conquer the wind of life, you must be a praise leader, not a prayer warrior. Mighty God, hello be on faithful God, you are worthy to receive all our praise for you alone. You are the song that I sing at the mention of your name. Every new must bow. Hear me? I told you and I repeat it. 2020. If you survive it, if you don't tell God thank you, you're ungrateful. And you who have seen now, in fact, you have to start rolling your drum. Because the only way to survive the remaining days. His gratitude. Not be money. Money is failing or has failed already. Government has failed. Science has failed. It's only God. Go and check it all over the world. The, death, the rate of death this year, it has never happened in the history of man. You that is alive, nobody say you chop stone. <laughs> 
Those who went down, they even have better things to survive than you. But he kept him. Mighty God, hallowed be your name. Faithful God, you are worthy to receive all our prayer. For you are Lord, you are the song that I sing. And the mention of your name. Every knee must bow. Unchangeable, unchangeable God, reliable, reliable God. Only you can do, Only you can do what no man can do. What no man can do. Unchangeable, unchangeable God, reliable, reliable God. Only you can do what no, no man. Can do. Hear me, God is still God. But the problem is that most times, little thing we are discouraged. Little thing. I've told you in this house, plus me and you, minus me and you, God is still God. He's a commander general. Whatever he say, you can't change it. You can't bribe God. The only way to mellow his heart is to worship him. Appreciate him. Even when he didn't do anything, thank him. Don't think, don't wait for the thing to happen. Praise him. Appreciate him. That's the only thing that moved him. One day I was in Lagos to seek for help. One of the market there, yeah, I don't know the name. So I went with my friend. So I was busy waiting for my friend because where I was going, he came for another thing, I came for another thing. I was looking because we arrived Lagos very late. So market have already started closing. So we have to go his own first before my own. And I was like, hell, I will not meet this man because the person you did not meet in shop in Lagos around 3 4. You have missed him. Before you get to where he is, he have left. I was angry with myself. And as I was there, I saw someone who is begging. I think the woman. Men I'm ready. See, here. I don't know what removed here. You've seen the tongue. And the best thing who follow him. That one is also blind. Now that one, the red song. And they look who they see. God says, see them. They are praising me. That one, they wave hand. They smile. And meanwhile, here is all. Even though you're giving the money, can't replace here. Now, that one, when they have that injury, was the one carrying the blind. The blind become the chorus leader. I don't know whether you have noticed it that most times people who are in, in problem they praise God more than those who are blessed. Talk to me many times. So I'm telling you, whether I want to come worship, whether I want to thank him, food we don't see yesterday. Go hospital now, or you go prison. There are some people who have been in wedding trial, they are innocent, and yet they can't come out in next year. Even when you, you go such place, when I went to sell years ago, because of somebody's issue, when I came out, I told myself, say, Kinsley, you are blessed. Blessing is not only money. You see yourself as a normal human being, healthy and alive, they lock you like goat. For who you are, for what you done, I come to praise you. For your mercies upon me, Mama Imela. For who you are, for what you done, I come to praise you. For your mercies upon me. Mama Ibela. So if you have attitude of a palm tree, I tell you, you will survive. You will cross. You will move across the year 2020. When the wind comes, you will bully. Him. And the wind will bypass him. And if you are the time who is complaining, showing your power, God will leave you. He said, I am the father to the fatherless. A husband to the widow. 
He said to him, Who vengeance will if you can avenge for yourself, God can God will not avenge for you. But if you believe, say no, you are my avenger, avenge for me, he will show up. Stretch your hand after this service. May God show up for your king. May God show up for your battle. In the name of Jesus. Anoma nunile anine nasio mama ira nini kereke anine nasio mama ewo ka iye nile kereke soro ya mama ewo ka iye nile kereke soro ya mama there is somebody watching me there. Don't kill yourself. As long as you are still breathing, there is hope. It's only a dead man that don't have tomorrow. Relax your mind. Wipe away your tears. There is still God. Mama, <laughs> I hear me, God is still performing miracles. If you never do your own, don't kill yourself. Go and go do them. When you see other people miracle, begin to celebrate God. Because after that person, you could be the next. One of my online viewers shared a testimony with me the other day. I was, when she called, I felt pain. After I dropped that call, I began to thank God. There are some things you hear in life. You say, God, is it possible? This woman says she had been waiting, believing God for fruit of the womb over 10 years. And suddenly she conceived. But there was issue, maybe because of her health. They had to, they now decide to operate her and remove the baby. So the, the doctors here, we are not giving her hope of seeing a child. Five months pregnancy. So there's no way you can think of having a child. But men and brethren, when they operated her, the baby cried. Five months. Chuku Idima 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 Chimarobibo Marekele Just worship him. He will turn body woman to mother or children. He will make nobody to become somebody. He can wipe the weight here. I shout it, thank you, Jesus. If you thank him, he will do something for you this year. Sit down. But now watch this. Another thing she said the first time she called. They brought out the baby, but there were a lot of issues. They have discharged her, but they have not discharged the baby. According to her, he said that baby had been in hospital for five months. Again, making ten months now. See battle. So the, the condition of the baby, any day they want to bring out the baby, the condition will change. And so many doctors report. So when she called me, I said, challenge God. He's the one that gave you the child. The blessing of the Lord, make it child, added no sorrow. And my Bible said that from the days of John, the baptism now, the kingdom suffered the valley. And the valley will take it back. I gave her assignment. I said, let's agree. The agreement that from now to two weeks, that baby will come out. Can he do it? He can. Uh, 
Isara mepere chine kodi gonye de kage. Ina puta rapuro bim kodi koli la nyabola. Isara mepere chine kem gonye de kage. Gonye ne me ma. Papa nara ekele. You hearing me as you worship him. Allow God, he will take over that battle. He will wipe away your tears. And the doctors were scared, even if they can handle the matter. So she did the prayer, concluded it. I told her, I said, plant a seed, tell God I have paid the bill. You can, God, I have settled it. Doctor, what you like, you do. You can, God can perfect it. So she concluded the prayer, called me back. I was shouting, say, your God, not God. Your God, not miracle worker. What happened? He said, doctors in America confirmed, say, this is God. All the things that we are scared, whether this baby will survive, God bypass all and rectify all. I told her, I said, two weeks never reach. We agreed. We have a deal with heaven. He never wanted to die. He said, man, I'm a kid. You know what she said? He said, my husband no believe. He said, but this one don't make her believe. I even didn't know that the husband was even there. He said, let me give him more phone so that you can pray for him. He no believe. He said, but now he don't believe. <laughs> May God give you miracle that will convince others. But there's one testimony. We will not hear that testimony in the world. Maybe on, on Wednesday we hear that testimony. It's a dangerous one. Men and brethren, things they this life, but thank God for God who is bigger than Babas. And that's why I praise him. Even though he never do my own, do somebody own. I begin thanking him. Because if we are 20 in line, he do one, he remain 19. <laughs> he goes to the Bobby Abere, Bobby Abere, Bobby Abere, Chimo. He goes to the Bobby now let me give you small about that testimony very very long one this woman called one day i told me she had been in europe for 30 something years and life had been dealing with her problems of life so i gave up prayer. i said declare war battle from your father's house battle from your mama's house battle from where you marry that join together let God dismantle them. So I gave her one week. He never finished the one week. Old. The thing don't scatter everywhere. The, he said one day he got a lot of calls. He started calling Nigeria. What happened? Which everybody is calling? They said many people they confess because of him. Now do you know the worst part that paid me? She was crying saying it. That's why I said we are going to give that testimony five minutes. Oh mother. He said, her wedding happened when she married. She's supposed to marry on 29th of that December. But her sister, the same mother, died on 27th. And wedding is 20. No, he didn't start there. He said, her marriage remained two weeks. Pastor that's supposed to wed her died. Two days to the wedding, her own sister died. So this wedding, how they wanted to do her? But they say she crossed her mind, do they? Because she don't come from Europe. But did you know men and brethren that she started the fasting? Mama confessed, said, Now you kill his sister to stop her marriage. You need to hear. You need to hear something. He own mama. He said, Mama kill my sister just to spoil my marriage. Mama, they confess. Uncle, where they build house for her, they confess. Hey, hey, hey. No, you need to hear this one. That we will not be in a hurry to hear that testimony. When I listen yesterday, I share. He declined, she declined. He said, he said, Pastor, you give me one week. He said, I'm not going to stop until God fitter them. <laughs> Somebody had a fire. You watching me over there. I put my knee on this altar. If I be a man of God, those who torment you, God will torment them. God will torment them. God will torment them. God will torment them. Will torment them. Oh, I feel something now. Men and brethren, hear this. There's one another thing she said that touched me. 
The uncle that confessed is the one building house for her. May they hear now if they give money, make it build house. Now she says something to me in that this thing. He said, when the uncle sink the house for her, the uncle told her, said, money remain 1.3 million that was remaining after sinking. He said, let her now call the man. Said, okay, what about the 1.3? Said the man. The man said, he take and buy sand. Sand, what do you want you sand do? 1.3 million. And the lady said, it's like they close her mouth. She didn't talk. Because there is something on ground. Now, what happened? The uncle was confessing. He said, he do and say, they no go finish the house. And he's the one building the house, using the land, doing farm. You didn't hear? So he went there. Now, what happened? He went to the same land to go to farm that day. Why this lady was praying? Bees gathered there, beat him. And that was where he started confessing. Be gathered on his brain, on his head. Begin. I, 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 I fear this God. Whoever they say you will not sleep, they will catch. Judgment will catch up with them. They are evil will catch up with them. Shout the Father. Every household we can net. Torment in my life. Da, da, da. Pray. In Jesus' name we pray. Now look at another one. I want you to pray. Those you carry in your body. And yet they are the ones sucking you. She told me, say, Uncle Nai de that uncle Nai de Bu has one. And meanwhile, he's the one who also buried something there. I said, they're not going to finish this house. He said, she don't build house, build house, build house. House not a green finish. One house. Zinc house finish. Money remain one part. He said, that one, he take and buy sand. Now, now grow the one grade. The house where they don't sink, finish. He said, use 1.3. They buy sand. And the lady said, no talk. Because something is wrong. What? He believed, but do you know God is God? Not only God, no hallow. But do you know what I heard? They said after the confession, as B, Biden, saw from up. Shout the Father. Every household enemy. Every enemy within my father's house. Within my family. Tormenting me. Fire exposed. Fire exposed. Open your mouth and pray. Ibu papa were picole no manya. Ibu mama mo we catch up on me. Ibu papa were picole no manya. Ibu mama mo we catch up on me. In Jesus name we pray. Wait, how will you describe this? A mother killed her own daughter to stop her the daughter's marriage. Kill pastor first. After killing pastor, he be like, "Say this guy, you know, you're, you know here, pastor." We say one word, the pastor sleep two weeks to wedding. She refused to change her mind. And mama said, "Okay, oh, you know one, you know one leave this marriage." And he told me that how many times that men have followed her, come down from Europe, they will go back. Because they said she no go marry. He said the uncle said, no, only you travel for the whole community, for the whole house. No, only you travel, only you. You see what? He told me that his, her own sister died 27th of December at the wedding, 29. Two days too. He said, but she had to cross her mind. Say, I don't come, I don't come. This marriage I could do. And Nadia is wicked, the mama. 
And this thing is long, but the woman refused to give up. But now power don't jam power. Shout the father. Any man or woman sitting on my happiness. Da! You watching me there declare anyone sitting on your happiness in that family, sitting on what you are looking for, sitting over your destiny. Malay, anybody. Whoever that sit. Yeah, 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 yeah. Whoever that say you can't have it, let God judge them. In Jesus' mighty name. We pray in Jesus' name. Another thing he said, he said, she had two girls. He said, Pastor, before I give birth to this cheap two girls, he said, now one, a life between life and death. He said, all of them are terrible operation to have that two girls. He said, Mama confessed, said they, they talk and say, you know, go feed bomb boy. Even if you born, now by, now he said, if not God, he said, Pastor, you give me one week. He said, I'm not going to stop this thing. until God fit them. <laughs> Even the husband family, somebody see the confession. Three people confessing at the same time. Let God arise and his, his enemy, enemy be scattered. Let God arise and his enemy be scattered. Let God arise and his enemy. Oh Lord, my God, Allah. Now you have a picture of anybody living abroad. Carry that picture up. Do you know say most times just move to the altar a little bit? Most times when some people here say they're abroad, their mind go God. Just only they hear say travel. You say you will carry my Lord. You say you will be my God, oh Lord. I am in your presence to have my own portion. You say you will carry my Lord. You say you will be my God, oh Lord. I am in your presence to have. Umu wana chochi chere, Jehovah na bia. Umu wana chochi chere, Jehovah na bia. Onu wana chochi chere, chere, Jehovah na bia. Onu wana chochi chere, chere, Jehovah na bia. Two prayer point. Any man or woman that is against this journey. You are going to mention that person name. Any whoever that is against him or her traveling abroad. Whoever that said that journey no go work. Open your mouth, pray. Let their Lord return back on their head. Whoever that said that journey, whoever that is against this one or that woman traveling out, Lord, let your judgment. Omega <laughs> Chuku bilie o bilie kaba bilie o you who is a guy open your mouth pray are you in Europe then go whoever that said that is angry that you traveled whoever that you're traveling to abroad was an offense open your mouth you watching me that your siblings that travel out pray for them whoever in that family that said that that is angry that they traveled across the country. Billy, 
In Jesus name we pray. Amen. Now look at the way we pray the second prayer. Shall be my father, my maker. Any man or woman that will impact on evil journey against this world. Or any man or woman who have impact on any evil journey to spoil this journey. In the name of Jesus. Where is the Lord God of Raman? Where is the Lord God of Raman? Where did that God answer by fire? Judgment by fire. Open your mouth and declare, Lord, judge your mission. Only one is it a reward? You must see how we are put in on our own. Thank you, Father. In Jesus' name we pray. Now lift up your right hand and shout in the name of Jesus, Father. I Kinsley, I, I stand in a gap for sister or brother. Call the name. This morning, I stand by the altar of God. I present your case. This journey will favor you in the name of Jesus. Put amen three times loud. Call him his or her name again. Shout in the name of Jesus. Whatever that is holding you there. Pray. 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 I break it out of your life. Hebrew chuku na de gabanwe. Hebrew chuku na de gabanwe. Hibu chuku na de gabanwe. Hibu chuku na de gabanwe. In Jesus' name we pray. Call that person's name again. Shout it in the name of Jesus. This journey will favor you. You will not return empty. Your dreams over there will be fulfilled. You are unstoppable. In the name of Jesus. Put him in seven times. Shout in every battle from your father's house. I stand in agreement with you. Whoever that is tormenting you abroad. In the name of Jesus. I bury them alive. Open your mouth and pray. Don't whoever tormenting you, whether in the dream or in the physical, tormenting you abroad. I bury them alive. I bury them alive. I bury them alive. I bury them alive. In Jesus' name we pray. This is a serious meeting, though. Lift up those and shout their, that person's name. If they are more than better, call their names now. Shout it in the name of Jesus. Whatever you are due for there that you don't have yet. From now to the 31st of December, receive it now. Pray. Their document, their job, their marriage. Children, whatever you are due for that you don't have, I release it to you. I release it to you. From now to the anniversary of December, you will testify it. You will testify it. You will testify it. I release you. That country will favor you. In Jesus' name we pray. Let 
Lift up that right hand as you, as you connect them. Now let's sing, sing this song. Your name is Sire. Above all. You watch it connect this prayer. Your name is Jesus. Your name is Lord. Yeah. Your name is Sire. Above all. Name. Your name is Jesus. Your name is Lord. Your name is Lord. Your name is Sire. authority over these ones where everybody are that one, those watching me all over the world if I be a servant of God if there is a genuine call upon my head by his mercy and his power whatever that tied you like rope on your leg whatever that had tied your marriage whatever that tied you as a young man as a young woman as a married man as a married woman in the name of Jesus I break that chain every battle from your father's house from your husband's family fighting you over there in the name of Jesus I command it break in the name of Jesus let it break in the name of Jesus let it break altar of your father's house it demons from your father's house household wickedness that say you stay there finish you will never come back with anything I command judgment against them I command judgment against them whatever they are using to fight you I return it back in the name of Jesus, I put my knee on this altar. Any strange altar, they waking because of you. Any strange altar, they raise because of you. I command that altar catch fire. I command that altar catch fire. I command that altar catch fire. In the name of Jesus, call them by their name and their son name again. In the name of Jesus, mention their name again. In the name of Jesus, you that is here, mention your name where you are. God said to Joshua, where the soul of your fish are mad. He said, possess the land. I put my two legs on this ground. Grace for possession rests upon you. That country where you are, you will not be stranded. Yes, I am talking to somebody now. That country will not reject you. They must give you document. In the name of Jesus, they must give you job. Every of your entitlement that the enemy have we told. From now to the 31st of December, I release all. I release all to you. Receive it in the name of Jesus. And here my conclusion. Whoever that will go back from today to summon you in any altar, to call you in any shrine, they will pay with their head. They will pay with their life. They will die in miserable death. Where is the Lord God of Remai? Where is the Lord God of Remai? Where did that God answer my fire? I lose their document where they tied it. I lose their job. I lose them. I lose their finances. I'm hearing something. I declare the way I am led. Some of them are building. They can't finish their project. They are making money, but they don't know what is eating the money. Today, that yoke is broken in Jesus. Look at what God told me now. He said their documents have been released. Because it's not to you both that is holding it. It is an evil hand here. And I hear God say their document have been released from that hand. I'm seeing somebody looking for a job, no job. I'm seeing somebody now, instead of even going why he's there, he's having problems, health issue. He, he, he went to abroad for greener pastor, but now, now for one sickness or the other. Hear me, whoever that wants to kill you, you will bury all of them. And whoever that gave you that sickness, at the sound of your amen, I return it back. I return it back. Just to confess, they would die. Thank you, Father, in Jesus' name. Can I hear your amen 21 times? Oh, yeah.
you do for me today? After this meeting, give them a call. Congratulate them. Speak hope. Tell them the power have changed hands. Go back to your seat. I'm done. I know I suppose have. Well, that was what is in my mind, but I don't know. He said to me, lift up your seed. As you drop this seed of thanksgiving, there will be thanksgiving in your family. There is joy in my heart. It's flowing like I will praise the Lord with thanksgiving of joy. Come and drop it on the altar. Come to the altar. As you touch that altar, you have triggered your blessing. Amen. Amen. Drop your offering. Drop your offering. God bless you. I will praise the Lord with thanksgiving of joy. I will praise the Lord with thanksgiving of joy. I will praise the Lord with thanksgiving of joy. I will praise Master Jesus with thanksgiving of joy. I will praise the Lord with thanksgiving of joy. There is joy in my heart. He's flowing like a river. I will praise the Lord oh, with thanksgiving. There is joy in my heart. He's flowing like a river. I will pray the Lord. Dancing with no joy. We are not going to go to online testimony this morning. I want to make sure I release your time. Now stand to your feet. Let me pray for you. Do you have anointing oil? You lift it up. I bless that oil. You point of contact for miracle. Whatever you use it for, may the name of the Lord be glorified. As you anoint yourself this morning, whatever that look like affliction, let it end in a hurry. You watching me there, affliction will not near you. You will not see shame. You will not see disgrace. In the name of Jesus. Anoint your head. That which we have prayed for, I believe is already settled. There is joy in my heart. It's flowing like a river. I will praise the Lord. Oh, with thanksgiving of joy. Stand to your feet, let me pray for you. As you live here this morning, the Lord answer you. The Lord remember you. Amen. Sister, there, can I pray for you? Nida, let me pray for you. What, I, look at me, what I want to declare this morning. Whatever that brought you here. Okay, you are from... Uh, okay. You are from Lagos? Yes. You are here to represent anybody? I'm here to... Okay, that one now sent you down. Yes, now sent us down. Look at the prayer I want you to do. Okay, both of you came. Okay. I want to give you the prayer. I know you want to see me, right? Even though I didn't see what I'm telling you is the answer. How is his journey there? How is he doing over there? Doing well. How many years have you been there? Close to 15 years. 
But have you come before? 15 years. Have you come? Yes, I have come more than three times. Three times. So we are expecting more things, more than what we are seeing. No, look at what I want you to do. I want you to, both of you, to pray for him. There are many eyes that is fixed on him. Because God wants to use him to change the family. But there are many enemies that want to spoil the journey. And at times he's having strange dreams like an attack. So ask him, he will explain it. But look at what I want you to do. Any battle from the father's house, whoever that said, you know, if you have. But the good thing is that the grace of God upon that young man's life is stronger than the battle. Declare that war. Whoever that said that journey no go fine, they will enter ground. And I perceive that somebody have died because of this evil, but nobody knew. Yes. But declare. Tell God, there are two people remaining who is not happy. But what they are doing, no, they reach his body. But God keep helping him. But tell God, because they, they made up their mind that they must see to the end. They have gone the first place, the second place, the third place. And those things keep reflecting to his dream. And when, the moment he pray, God, God show up. But declare, join him and pray. Tell God, he should frustrate whoever that wants to quench the light that is in your family. Three days prayer. When you finish, tell him, put the seed on the altar and watch what will happen. Who we'll say the water no go boil? And I pray for you, God. Whatever that is fighting you. Can I have all you there? Whatever that is fighting you. How is your health? Yeah? It's not good. For how long now? Since I, since I married this uh, seven years now. It have been from one illness to the other. But when you went to her doctor, what did they say? Did they find out anything? Now, do you have anointing oil there? Okay, go and buy. Get oil outside there. Let me pray. I want to give you a sign. You know, as we pray, we leave it and watch what God will do. And there is somebody there watching me. There is somebody online. Today, now your day. And you are happy since to finish that prayer. You believe that. In fact, what have, the prayer I have been waiting for, now today it happened. And that, that's how the matter settled. Whoever that say you will return empty, mortuary will be receiving the one after the other. I have prayed. Whoever that say your water no go burn, hey. whoever that say that journey no go walk, ground will cover them. Or those who say they will not remove their hand from evil. Now let me ask. Let me see. Remind you that woman testimony. When I listened to it, I said, you know, at time when you say some things, you say, is it possible, Mama? his own child how to kill the daughter just to spoil the sister's marriage two days to the marriage no wonder the Bible says suffer the witch not to live they are, they are heartless he keep pastor first he no do he sister the lady still they prepare for the marriage he kill his sister Maybe that one will make her change mind. And she refused. And completed that. Because she now not, he said she suspected that the bad enemy, he said because she had made many attempts to marry. But let me tell you, if you don't get hurt, you don't go feed those. And maybe go surprise they are close. Lord, bring power into this or a point of contact for miracle, total deliverance and restoration. Manifest your power and let there be miracle. Do the impossible through this and take all the glory. Thank you, Father, because you're faithful. In Jesus' name. Now, do you know what you're going to do? Because at times I, you, you eat in the dream. So I want that each deposit to flush out. Eh? Regularly. Because that is what is making the whole situation to be the way it is. Now, so you, as you are doing that three days prayer, you start using this anointing oil. It is seven days, three times every day. Tell God whatever you are carrying in your body that look like poison. Today, you will be like, say you are okay. Tomorrow, you will be like, say the whole thing scatter. Because that's how it's happened. Let God rectify it. Let God heal you and restore you back. And I believe if you do that prayer with your spirit, soul, and body, I, I see healing coming. Your sugar will return. Those weakness is going to disappear. All those strange symptoms and those battles in your dream, you will conquer all. I anoint you. I decree victory. I decree testimony. Sister, can I touch your two hands? Money will have value in your hand. You will hold money and you, it will stay. In the name of Jesus. Case closed.
God bless you. Stretch your hand as you leave this home. May the Lord rectify your matter. Whatever that is making you to cry, God turn it into testimony. Bad news is cancelled from your way. That sister, we are in red and uh, white. Let me pray for you. Lead and let me pray. Remove your attack. Whatever that is covering you, I remove that covering. At the count of three, whatever covering you, let it break. One, two, three. Lisa! And let her go. Let her go. In Jesus' name. I free you. Settle. Switch your hand. This year will not pass you by. What is yours? Rita, come. Give me your right hand. Oh, you put it on your forehead. Whatever that is attacking your prayer life, I deal with that thing now. In the name of God, the Father, Son, and the Holy Ghost, I release fresh oil on your head. Boom! Receive it. In the name of Jesus. Every strange thing happening around you, in the physical and the spiritual, to kill your prayer life. Lose her! Let her go! Thank you, Father. I free you. two hands. I bless you. No power will swallow your happiness. Whatever that is yours, go back and recover. I bless you. I bless your children. I bless your household. I bless your marriage. I bless your going out. I bless your coming in. I bless the fruit of your labor. Be blessed in the name of Jesus. Thank you, Father. In Jesus' name. Another amen. The loudest amen. amen. May we share the grace and fellowship by the grace of our Lord Jesus Christ. The love of God and the sweet fellowship of the Holy Spirit. Rest and abide with us now and forevermore. Surely, goodness and mercy, favor and glory, anointing and power shall follow us all the days of our lives. And we shall dwell in the house of the Lord forever and ever. Go and may the Lord bless you in Jesus' name.